Here's my opinion about Here's the thing, I noticed that a lot of people are saying this a lot, but there's a rumor going around for the uh, hanging munchkin, but I don't see it in the video at all. I noticed that originally it was a bird because it was originally in a VHS release. And if, you know, and, um, oh, you know, I don't know why that is any important about Wizard of Oz, but I don't get it. I really don't. Uh, with the high dimension, I don't get it. What? Maybe it was a remastered VHS tape and then they just showed it, show it and uh, claim it. But nobody seems to understand the show up uh, as much. The only thing I, I kind of I kind of wish that people would understand more is people always seem to forget the the you know that this was one of the best uh, yeah one of the best YouTube uh, YouTube videos of all time and well I am kind of sick of YouTube at the moment. And I know I gotta post this on YouTube. I'm trying to figure out why is it that people say that when it's not true. This will be the last time. Um, this will be my last time of posting any videos because I can get my anger out on YouTube because YouTube is being a pain in the ass with copyright laws and stuff. And yet I thought I believed them for, you know, copyright. They sue me for this video then. I blocked my video for making a, a, a YouTube fucking thing. Claim that then. On my fucking channel. Jeez. It's not even supposed to be that funny. Jeez. Copyright grounds. Gee, do you know what people would do just to say this? This Wizard of Oz here? Try blocking me now, YouTube. Try blocking me now. Seriously, YouTube. Because this is my last chance. This is my chance to see if I can trust you or not. This is your final chance. I will be not making any more YouTube videos. And I will be... I will... I just had a guts well. Seriously. All I keep doing is making YouTube videos about videos. And all you're doing is claiming... What is right, which is isn't. And then you put an apology on it saying, Sorry about law. So if to say that. And then you put a sad face or maybe a meme face. You know, when it's half happy, half sad. And you think that's fair? You think that's fair, you two? And the fair use? <sighs> the same thing I can make an excuse for is Power Rangers. Seriously, you cannot leave the YouTube site alone, copyright people, people with original copyright. Leave YouTube alone. Leave the copyright as it is. Jeez, it's under for use. It's YouTube, we're crying out loud. This goes for Power Rangers and all. This isn't just Wizard of Oz, but people have put films up like Wizard of Oz, and I wouldn't be surprised if they get taken down. Because of copyright. It's getting worse every year with copyright. And you know what's worse? Fucking ads. On, you know the modern ads that I don't like? Yeah. I am still ranting about that. YouTube. Listen to me now. You claim copyright on YouTube. And I shall go forth and sue your copy. I'll take you into court. I will take you into court and I'll take you to lawsuit and sue your fucking ass for having us prosecution. As they say in Ghostbusters. And I am not joking around. As it is bonfire night and I'm making this video, I hope I make that clear to you, YouTube. Go ahead. Blow up my videos. Because as soon as you do. I am not making any more videos. This is my last time I ever used this camera. 
And this is my last time I'll ever use it. And if you keep claiming copyright, I swear by it. This is the end of Andrew Warbioff. And yeah, this is going to be the last video I ever make. Jesus fucking Christ, it's you too for crying out loud. I know you're trying to block people who are good at videoing by spamming their channel. YouTube, I don't care who you are. I don't care who the company is who's blocking people on YouTube. But whoever it is, stop it with the copyright. We had WMG for taking volumes off uh, YouTube. And now we got this. I am telling you, this is my last time I ever use this camera. And this is my last time I'll ever go on YouTube. Because if YouTube doesn't realize soon, I will be I will be uh, doing this. Because this will go as well. And this was, and DSP Gaming, if that gets taken down, right, uh, for copyright. I swear to God, right, whether it's Ghostbusters or Heavy Rain, LPN, those games... I swear to God, I will not watch YouTube for the rest of my life. Well, whatever games that be in LP, they be in LP to give people the advantage. They are strategy guides for the bloody... That, that's the reason. It's a strategy guide for the fucking game, for crying out loud. Uh, like Sonic Adventure, for example. Sonic Adventure 2. Yeah. Like, uh, Heavy Rain. Uh... Uh, Ghostbusters, and you know what really, really winds me up? How the hell people don't like uh, normal heroes? I understand uh, people don't like it because it's frustrating the heart. I understand that, but my little rant here is, you know, people don't really seem to realize that you can't claim if it's under fair use, because it's unfair for the user of YouTube. So if YouTube is doing this, then what's the point of being on YouTube? What's the point of these ads claiming the shit on YouTube? I don't care if I'm swearing. I am absolutely sorry for the people who get offended by my swearing, my cursing and whatnot. But this is one thing I say. Fuck you, YouTube. Seriously. That's the only thing I got from them. And if you think about blocking Power Rangers, I am definitely not going to go ahead and use YouTube anymore. Because there's no point in putting clips on it. Might as well put the sh entire show on YouTube. If that's the case, then I might as well say this. We might as well sue YouTube. Because YouTube, I'm on to you. Really am. Um, you said under fair use. Was it Blackbuster Critic and other people have said it's under fair use? Well, yeah, it is. But where's the point if it's going to be copyrighted or blocked for that purpose? Whoever you are out there, whoever the copyright people think is fair, to, to, that's it. That, that big fart there that I just did, that's, on your, that's my answer to you too. Fuck you. Yeah. That's what it's going to be called. It's not going to be called YouTube. It's just going to be a big fuck you. In front of all the users. And the ones who are making money on YouTube. They're the ones who's going to be going. Big fuck off. To the youth. By, by people who don't use us. Or watch us. And then you make rants about. Why we avoid adverts. The reason is to avoid adverts is on YouTube. And the only reason I watch the classic ads is because I try to watch them. Because I like the old PIFs. I like the old versions of PIFs. But claiming the copyright on old PIFs is... Well, seriously. They're original, they're classic, they're not like what they are today, and they're still claiming that. And there's fireworks going off outside. As I expect, because it's the 5th of November. 
I am ranting about this because, well, as you can tell, I do not like how people can tell me how to go about my way. I know what will suit. I know what. I know what's unfair. Not allowing people to LP games on the internet. Not allowing people to watch video games of their favorite characters on the internet. Not allowed to watch their favorite TV show on the internet. Like SWAT cats and th Thundercats from the 80s or of real Ghostbusters. What if all that came uh, um, from copyright? Just happened. I'm lucky I got the real Ghostbuster Fyros package from the internet, but that's because my brother had the credit card, and he was the only one who got me Power Rangers from Mike Morphin to Zero, I think. Yeah, you know, to, uh, sorry, in space. Yeah, he got, got me all them, because you can only use the credit card on the internet. And that's another big rant I, I'm going to uh, claim. You can't use postal order, order, postal order, when you order something online. No, no, it's got to be credit cards. It's fucking credit cards. I mean, who the fuck makes you uh, use a credit card, you know? Oh, it makes me mad. I, I swear by it. It's, it's a big failure on the internet side. Nobody's going to buy anything online. If, if you go use a credit card, and I can't, I'm not allowed a credit card, which is the reason I can't use Microsoft points, because you got to use the credit card, this is the only means to get points on your 360 and the PS3, and not to mention the PS3 is now superior to the 360, because of the copy, uh, bloody security proof. And I, I'll get into that topic late, uh, quite late and make a last video on that. But what I'm trying to say is, fucking hell. I mean, for fuck's sake, it's the same everywhere I go. Oh, look, you, t you know Wizard of Oz is, um... And the real Ghostbusters, and I hear about this a lot with, uh, uh, what, uh, what do you call it? All the classics that came out years ago, right? And they put it on Blu-ray. Guess what they're saying? It's too grainy. There's nothing good about Blu-ray then, I take it. Because you're watching modern crap on Blu-ray, and... Why would you want to have new films based on that, when th that's the main reason that classic is, you know, I understand, like, there shouldn't be a full frame, should be, like, because how old the movies are, if it's black and white, it should, and it's on Blu-ray, it should have, like, a side frame, you know, for example, this is a full frame year, and you would have, like, this side year, and the other side framed, you know, so it's not, like, uh, it's like a sort of standard definition on the Blu-ray. That's fine. But the problem is, people just run, uh, make me want to tear out their lungs and send them to the fucking Zani Rice Rock video and show them that this is how I feel about people who don't agree to his channel. Yeah, Sean is pretty cool. Well, anyway, enough of me blabbering on about, you know, uh, about my rant there. This is Andrew Wolfgang, Sayonara, all the things, good things to say goodbye with, which it isn't good because it's YouTube.